God damn it! All right, here we are. Part 14, Chapter 14. This is the last chapter of Max Payne 3. Today, we're going to end it. Hope you enjoy it. Okay, Max. Now you check the main terminal. I'm going to go and look for the Bronco plane by the hangar, okay? Let's do it. You keep an eye out in there. You know Becker's going to have some guys in there watching out for you. Yep. So, of course, I knew they were looking for me. But the airport was about the only place a fat gringo might blend in. Well, there or a sex club. My delusions of disguise lasted around two seconds. <laughs> they were out in force. And they were out for me. But then, I was out for them too. Every last one of those bastards. Sounds like a man on a mission to me. I think he's just... He's sick of getting used, and now I think he's out for revenge. <laughs> yeah, now that he's made it through check-in, if memory serves, there's about 300 other people I need to go through. Alright. This is a good chapter. One of my favourite chapters, if not my favourite. Here we go. Oh man. Yep, I remember this. <laughs> I remember him killing me several times. We're actually kind of low on ammo, but we do have two guns. Oh, that bloody laser sight trying to blind me. Right, let's just stay here in the tunnel. That works, that works. I know there's a guy around there, though I didn't kill him, did I? We need to get out of here. I'm, I'm fighting against the conveyor belt right now, and it, it's kind of working, but I don't think I can ever back out of this. Right, let's go, let's go. Whoa. Did I get him? Did I get... No, shoot through the bottom. Can you do that? No, shit. Keep jumping, man, keep jumping. There's one guy, he's dead, okay. Keep jumping. <laughs> Shit. Keep jumping, keep jumping, just in case. There you go. I'm just exposed from every angle, you see, so if I take cover behind this, I'll get shot from behind. I mean... Oh. No, I didn't kill them all. Shit, now I did. Right, okay. We are running out of ammo, but a laser sight? Yeah, don't mind if I do. I'm not particularly a fan of the laser sight itself, but I'll take a rifle. Alright, let's see. Can I actually calm down now? Are we okay? There's a sea of dead bodies. I want to pick up as many guns and as much ammo as I possibly can. I'm looking for a rifle without a laser sight, honestly, because I don't really trust these too much. Ah, I, do you see what I see? I remember this one, actually. Yeah, there's a, a golden gun part up here. Uh, or a golden grenade launcher part up here. One of three. Okay, nice. <laughs> Fight my way back down the conveyor belt, and I guess let's go in here. Yeah. Um, I guess let's stick with what we've got for the time being. I'll put up with the laser sight. And see how it goes. Wouldn't be surprised at all if I died several times during this chapter. It's, uh, it's, it's probably the hardest in the game. Oh, hang on. Here we go. See, another reason that I don't really like the laser sight. I think if I actually had the, the white dot on the screen, I could shoot through this wall. But because the laser sight means you have to follow where the gun is pointing... I can't do that, if that makes any sense. But yeah, some of the kills that I've got throughout the game so far, just using the uh, the white dot and the screen, I just can't do with this, and <laughs> let's just hide back here, shall we? Let's let them come to me. Yeah, I actually have to poke my head out this time and use a painkiller, shit. Okay, I guess I could use this. Oh, there you go. He couldn't see me, but I could see him, you know what I mean? I will admit it's kind of bullshit, the way the uh, the game's mechanics work like that, but it's it's serving me well. It's keeping me alive most of the time. And I really do like this pistol. I don't like how little ammo I have for it, though. Let's go back to the Desert Eagle. I, I'm fairly sure there's still one over to the, uh, to the right, you see. I'm certain there is now. <laughs> Where are you? Right. Let's make him expose himself. I think he's over there somewhere. Can I bind this? Yes, I can. Okay. Yep, there you go. 
Go on, do it one more time. One more time. That's all I needed. All right, nice one. Again, let's go collect all we can. Very nice, very nice. All right, what, what we got to work with? Another pistol? Nah. It felt like my vacation was coming to an end. Oh, don't lock the Although door. I wasn't heading home with a sunburn, a bag full of duty free, and a dose of VD. Shit, there's probably loads I of stuff I missed. That would put me in handcuffs or a body bag. Oh well, we got to work with what we got. Anything else? Oh, I saw a gun. I swear I did. There you go. <laughs> Anything over there? No. Someone's still yelling. Someone's still shouting. Oh, where's that coming from? Let's grab his gun, shall we? Oh, I like it. No laser sight either. Very nice. Just round the corner? It's got to be just round the corner, right? Oh, <laughs> yes. Yes, okay. Right, what about... Oh, shit, we can go in here. Oh, my God. Okay, cool. Anything? Clues? Painkillers? Gun parts. Or grenade launcher parts. Nothing. <laughs> I knew it wasn't nothing. Bloody hell. Oh, you're, you're still alive? Of course, these guys have the most armor out of anyone you meet in the game, really. These were Becker's guys. Yeah. Him and Victor had a private airport to go with their private army and their private jet. In here? Yeah, let's do it. This let's do it. the back office. They'd be on their way to the nearby lounge. No doubt. And we will be on our way very soon. In fact, I actually might pick that up, yeah. Back to this, though. Just to be sure. Through there? Looks like it might be through there. Toilets? Absolutely, yeah. I'm getting the uh, I'm getting the jitters before another flight, you know? I want to see if I can find some painkillers or golden guns. Ah, <laughs> there you go. All right, one more part to find of that grenade launcher. Airports always made me nervous. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. Is it this way? No, it's not. Got to be this way. The doors lead in the direction of the main terminal. Well, let's hope so. Okay. I see Nothing painkillers. Was happening back here. I had to get to where the action was. In a moment, you know, <laughs> I've got to check every single stall. The customer restroom. I could get through to the departure gates oh. up ahead. Okay, I'll take your word for it. You seem to know the layout of this place. There were Ufe all over the airport, and oh, civilians right. were being moved out. Looking at it one way, shutting down the airport for their escape was a weird sort of compliment. <laughs> but one I didn't need. I think they're finally realizing the threat against them. Alright, here we go! Good start, I think. Okay, don't really want to move straight away. But this is a very long terminal. It's going to be a very long fight. Nice, nice, nice. Okay. Let's move up a little bit. Go from baggage to baggage if we need to. Right, I don't really want to be on a conveyor belt if I'm completely honest with you. I don't think we've got anything up there. I don't know if we've got anyone up there, though. Let, whoa, here we go. Go on, poke your head out. Just that little bit. Ah, keep missing. Ah, I think I saw the X. I think he's dead. I think I got him. Okay, all right. Yeah. Half the reason I remember this chapter is because of this music. I think it works very well with what you got to do. Oh, man. <laughs> Shit. So far, so good, really. No complaints. It's a good thing I collected all those parts last time so I could do this in gold. <laughs> Are you alright there? <laughs> oh, let me help you out. Oh my god. You're stuck. That's crazy. I've never seen that. There's <laughs> some glitchy elements in this game. Maybe this was just like an extended beta test for uh, GTA V. Oh! <laughs> that 
Thanks for revealing the painkillers, though. I didn't notice those. Okay. Should we go up there? I guess we probably should. Still looking for grenade launcher parts, of course. Alright. So far, so good. Let's go back on ourselves a little bit. Something's telling me there might be something hidden around here. Or maybe not here. Maybe on the other side. Yeah. On the other side, maybe. I'll collect those painkillers in a moment. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Right, okay, hang on. <laughs> maybe I'll collect them now and go search the other side in a moment. Yeah, okay. Right, let's see. What are we, what are we dealing with? Right, this guy down there. Shit. Come on, man. There you go. Made up for the recoil. Oh, shit. <laughs> I actually might have, like, the best selection of guns for this at the moment. This is pretty cool. Be nice if I had an Uzi, though, to replace this. Right. I'm going over. Did I get him? Oh, I hit him. Ah, got him. There you go. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Yeah, I think when I was originally going through this, I I think I was probably playing hard mode, and I think I died maybe four or five times by this point. That bit on the conveyor belt at the very beginning is very, very difficult to deal with if you don't know what's coming up. And so I was jumping around all over the place. Okay. That guy can't decide whether to go up or down. And I don't blame him. He should probably go home. Right, if he's going to do a dance over there for a while, I am going to go over here and I'm going to see if I can find some more of this grenade launcher. Seriously? Nothing? Oh, I feel I should be thorough. There, there might be something just behind that last pillar. No? Wait, is that it? Yes! There it is! It was hard to see, but it's not the grenade launcher. An RPD, bloody hell, okay. Was that what he had? Hmm. Let's see. Nah, I'm going to stick with this. Okay, who else do I have to kill? Are you still doing a dance? Is that you over there? Yes, it is. <laughs> Fuck it, hell. Alright, maybe I'll be better off if I go down there, actually. I don't know. We've got conveyors. Might as well use them. Shoot this guy in the legs, make him trip up. Nice ragdoll death, maybe. Ah, oh, you always fall the wrong way. Right. Here we go, then. <laughs> That's more like it. That's what I wanted out of you. The gate had opened at the other end of the departure lounge. Really? Are there people coming through it? Or? Yep, evidently so. Should have probably just sprayed before I asked that question. you as well, and now I'm actually stuck on the fucking conveyor. <laughs> Keep jumping. Nice. Ooh. Oh, this is what I should have done. I'd have been so protected. That'd have been amazing. <laughs> oh, I probably should get up. I think that was the last guy. We're all right. They weren't here. I had to keep moving down through the airport. Well, as long as you keep following the sound of gunfire and these people stamping their boots. We're going in the right direction. Anything up here? What about on this side? This far side? This far corner, maybe? Hmm. Dunno. Can't see anything right now. Alright, we're going back down, I think, and, uh... I don't know, do we have to go through that shutter that they came through? I suppose we do. I don't think there's a... Do we go through there? Oh no, there's a button, and I know what to do with buttons. Oh boy. Yeah, it's not quite over yet. Seriously, greatest handgun in the world. Love it. Absolutely love it. 
right. The tram to the next terminal was down the escalators. I'm sure it was. I'm sure it was, but... Whoa, okay, yep. Yeah. Let's maybe deal with this guy first. Oh, and his friend. Ah. Just wondering if there's something over here worth picking up. Hint, hint. Maybe I can go in there. Get myself a meal. No, not today. Painkillers, though. There you go. I'm on six. I don't think I've ever been on six painkillers in this level before. I see you. Okay. Oh, God, there's a guy over there. I almost didn't see him. Damn. I'm surprised I haven't really hurt my head doing that yet. <laughs> I've been mean, crashed into a few walls. Oh, wait, why am I doing that? That's dumb. Let's go this way. <laughs> oh, shit, look at this. Like a million places they can come from. Look at all these doors. What, have I got to go on board? I <laughs> don't like the sound of that. We'll have a look at that. Oh, shit. Okay, now I kind of wish I had one of these guns with a flashlight. Like you, I think. I think I saw a flashlight on yours. It's kind of hard to tell where they are, really. Is that...? Yep, that, that, that's moving. That's not some weird shadow. Whoa. Looks like a control room. It didn't look like there'd be any trams leaving until the power was on. Right, yeah. Okay, flashlight, that's more like it. Oh, but it's this gun. I say that like it's a bad thing. Hmm. Yeah, okay. Well, let's go on board, just to make sure there's nothing over here that we are missing. I'm fairly sure there's something around this tram. It looked like they'd cut the power off in the office at the end of the platform. I know, I know. That was where I'd get it running. I'm sure. I'm sure you're right. Alright, never mind. False alarm again. Okay, a little bit more ammo. That will come in kind of handy. Thank you. And maybe, yeah, I don't know. Yep. <laughs> I said I didn't like doors. Here we go. Trams were running again. Maybe they'd take me to my gate. Maybe they'd bring more guys wanting to whack me. Maybe both. Probably both. <laughs> Probably both. Definitely both. Oh my god. One. Two. Ah. Missed the third. Is that... No. You... Yep. I, I saw you spawn, you sneaky buggers. This is the greatest gun ever. <laughs> it really is. Oh, shit. All right. Now, I think in that cutscene, yes, I did. I did see some painkillers. I deal with my remaining substance abuse issues when this was all over. <laughs> right. Was I missing anything over here by any chance? I mean, we don't have a tram to go to. I probably can't go through those doors. No golden gun parts hiding in the bin or anything like that? No? Okay, I guess we're uh, we're going aboard. And we were off. I felt like I might be able to recharge for a second. At least until we pulled into the station and met more murderous assholes. <laughs> but that's the thing with this chapter. It's kind of silly, but there is no rest. Of course there'd be a tram full of goons trying to derail me. Do I actually need to kill any of these guys? I probably do. I might... They might climb a board or something, I think. I don't know. There you go. There's number one. Okay. I think I might have to move up. Because there's no... Oh, hang on. Nope. Not quite yet. Ah, damn it. Almost killed Agent 47 over there. Although I can't say that. I'm as bold as he is.
<laughs> Accuracy, a little bit askew when I'm going at this speed, I think. Nice. Alright. Next window, maybe. Oh. Well, you know what, actually? They're actually coming down to me, so maybe I don't need to move at all. 500, not bad. How many people have I killed so far? Like, maybe a hundred? Plenty more to go. <laughs> All right. It was perfect. Everyone wanted a ticket for the Max Payne Express. Can you blame him? Right, again, like I do with all the smoke, I'm just going to wait. If I can. I'm not going around there until I can see what I'm getting myself into. Blimey. No, 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 don't you dare get up. <laughs> That's it. Did I see it? Yeah, I did see another one, okay. At least it looks like I don't have to worry about the one to my left anymore. Bloody hell. Is he dead? Yes, he is. Bloody hell. Okay. Oh, my God. No! Moving around all over the place because of the way the train's jolting about. Yeah, just this once. Go on. <laughs> Please let me pick up that gun again. Oh, no! I felt like I'd missed out on the joke. Oh. And it was a real good one. <laughs> Good thing I shot out the windows already. Oh, man. Look at that. Everyone's falling on the floor. Got to get them while they're down. That's another headshot. I think... Yep, I got him. I got him. That rifle, though. The tram was Damn. slowing down. And I'd only just gotten on board. I had to salvage what I could and see what was waiting for me. All right. So I think I've discovered that, yes, nine painkillers. That is the max you get in this game. Right. Maybe it was this tram I was thinking of. Maybe there's something back here. Here we go. The RPD again. Okay. All right. We're looking for two more parts. One of each. It had taken me right into the heart of it. Becker's gimps were everywhere, so he and Bronco must be close. The smart move would have been sticking with De Silva and going straight to the hangar, but when was I ever about smart moves? I'm a dumb move guy. <laughs> hey, Max, we'll drive onto the runway. No thanks. Let me walk in the main entrance. I'll put a big shit-eating grin on my face and let these assholes take turns trying to kill me. That's my style, and it's too late in the day to hope for change. Boy, were they throwing numbers at this problem. But then, I'd chosen to be here. I wanted this. Was it redemption? Not really. It was pathetic desperation. And not much else. The further in I got, the more guys I saw. Becker wasn't running a police force. He was running an army. These guys were better trained and better equipped than anyone I'd seen out here. And I'd seen some mean sons of bitches. The mission was screaming suicide, but I didn't give a damn. At least I'd die being a pain in the ass. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there he is. There the bastards were, sneaking off in their rich kid's toy. Not if I have anything to do with it. I ain't got nowhere else to go, Becker! Mr. Payne! Oh, I, I hate you. you had something to say to me! I hate this fight. <laughs> Him and his damn grenade launcher. Here we go. And everyone else that I've got to kill. Okay. So there's you. There's you. You guys. Bloody hell. What was that? Was that a grenade? I don't know. And we got more coming. And all the while, you have to worry about him firing his grenades, and he is accurate, extremely accurate. And I'm pretty sure there's no way you can really hide in this uh, this little hangar here, where he can't get to you. Shinner! 
Fuck, I didn't see that guy. God damn it. Might be wasting uh, a lot of my bullet time, to be perfectly honest. Jesus Christ! Okay, well, I, I'm alive. It's not going exactly as planned. Fucking hell. Look at all of this. This is insane. Wait, wait where? Oh, there you are. <laughs> I thought I saw you over there somewhere. Nice. Okay. It's getting away, though. Nice. Oh, arm as well. Holy shit. This was it. It was almost over. So I guess I'd become what they wanted me to be. A killer. Some rent -a clown with a gun who puts holes in other bad guys. Well, that's what they had paid for, so in the end, that's what they got. Say what you want about Americans, but we understand capitalism. You buy yourself a product, and you get what you pay for. And these chumps had paid for some angry gringo without the sensibilities to know right from wrong. Here I was, about to execute this poor bastard like some dime store angel of death, and I realized... They were correct. I wouldn't know right from wrong if one of them was helping the poor and the other was banging my sister. But I let him live. I think I did have a choice there. Let him feel the pain a little longer. Get in, Max! Oh, Christ. Yeah, it's not over. Now we're getting silly again. We had one card left to play. Just get me close. We're not gonna let him get away. God, I haven't used this yet. I don't know. I don't know where I need to shoot exactly to get this right. Okay, that's working. Oh my God! Look at this. <laughs> oh my God! Nice. Yes. That about sums it up. Gee, you think? <laughs> At least I don't have to worry about my own health. It's just a car, really. Oh, it's this one I need to worry about. That thing is powerful. Got him, got him. <laughs> Not quite as fun, is it? That's it. That's it. Just narrowly missing that takeoff there. Who's going to kneecap him, honestly, but yeah, that'll do. Should probably do it to the other leg as well, after what he's been putting us through. The 
55th Battalion of the City Police's Special Forces Unit, who have been implicated in human trafficking, has been disbanded indefinitely. Meanwhile, Victor Bronco, the politician at the center of the scandal, who is accused of laundering money from the scheme to fund his political campaign for mayor, was yesterday found hanged in his police cell. It's not yet clear whether his death was a suicide or simply retribution for his part in a scandal that has so many families missing loved ones that were kidnapped and killed. City officials say a full investigation Local is justice. underway. Local residents expressed outrage as they have been let down by both law enforcement and That's one way to do a forecast, I suppose. And there you have it. The end of Max Payne 3, and I think the end of the Max Payne series as a whole. I don't believe there's going to be any more games after this. Uh, although, that's what I thought after 2, so you never know. Um, I quite like that ending, although I don't really like that ending to wrap up Max Payne's story, really. I think 1 ended it very sort of romantically, poetically, beautifully. 2, again, was heartbreaking, but uh, it was a beautiful end to the series. But to leave it on this ending, I mean, the ending, that 30 second cutscene you just saw, doesn't really hit me in the same way, you know? I mean, I guess it's nice that he's maybe found some sort of paradise, maybe he's finally having that holiday and having a sliver of, uh, of, of happiness that he's always wanted, which is nice, but yeah, it doesn't hit me in the same way that 1 or 2 did, which is a bit of a shame. And so for that reason, I kind of want to see a Max Payne 4 to really wrap it up, but in, yeah, in many more ways, I think Max has, has had his time in the limelight, and we should probably just leave this character and his story alone. But yeah, a very, very fun game to play through. Hopefully it was fun to watch as well, and I hope to see you back in another playthrough very soon, all right? Thanks for watching. See you next time. I, I'm fairly sure there's still one over to the uh, to the right, you see. I'm certain there is now. <laughs> nothing. <laughs> I knew it wasn't nothing. <laughs> oh, let me help you out. Oh my god. You're stuck! That's crazy! I've never seen that. I, I can't decide whether to go up or down. And I don't blame him. He should probably go home. A gate had opened at the other end of the departure lounge. Really? Are there people coming through it, or...? Yep, evidently so! Oh, wait, why am I doing that? That's dumb. Let's go this way. <laughs> this is the greatest gun ever. <laughs> it really is! Oh, shit! Yeah, just this once. Go on. <laughs> Please let me pick up that gun again. Oh, no! Nice! Yes!